So let's discuss progress bars in Bootstrap. So in order to create a progress bar, we need a couple things. We need an outer class of progress. We don't have to have this, but it, it helps with the styling. Uh, this progress bar class to actually make this work. We need a width, and this is determined by the style class in order to uh, determine the size. Since we're changing this over time, um, we're binding to the style class to a class in the back end that's changing this number over time, and that number is denoted by this percent class, and I wrap it in a style class, which returns a string that is appropriate to the, the style. And it's basically just the width and a percentage of the width. So we have a min, min max here, and this is for screen readers, uh, an initial value of zero, that's just for screen readers, a roll progress bar for screen readers. So let's just show you what happens. Oh, and we have a height here. So we need to define the height. Otherwise, it'll be a varying length. So we can make this really tiny if we wanted to. It's going to look funky because we got numbers in there. The numbers don't show up. Yeah. So those are the numbers right there as it's going. So I made this about 30 pixels high in this particular case, just so we could get a nice uh, view of the number. Um, so let's take out the progress bar to show you what that looks like real quick. There's not a lot. We lose this little gray. There's a gray backing, if you can tell, uh, a little bit of rounded angles. But that's just the outer style. So if we take out this progress bar, that's where it really doesn't look good. So we get the, the little grayness right here, but we get none of the width or none of the, the blue scrolling uh, view that we had there. So let's turn that back on. Um, so let's go on the back, kind of show you how we're making everything work. Um, so just to kind of show you how this starts up in the initialization, we just have a timer here, delays for a second, runs every 100 milliseconds, increments by one, when it gets to 100, goes back down to zero. So this is running one through 100 all the time, we have this set to a number here, uh, starts out at zero, and once again increments. And then this is our style, we need width, colon, the number and then the percent. So that's how I hook this up uh, in order to get the progress bar to work. It's a pretty simple control. Uh, and I hope after going through this kind of demystifies what is going on with the progress bar. Uh, and if you like this, comment, uh, criticism, concerns, uh, send them below, subscribe, all that fun uh, social media stuff. Thanks.